So you're thinking of trying a pure bar class. Now you may be wondering, is it fun? Is it worth it? Is it culty? I'm Allison Obler, a professional aerialist and personal trainer, and I'm here to give you my opinion that nobody asked for. Pure Bar is the world's biggest bar workout chain, so it's likely that there's one in your area. Everyone was super nice, the studio was really clean and inviting. Unfortunately, I wasn't allowed to film in class, so enjoy this random stock footage I pulled. We started out with a dynamic warm-up just like that, and everything was to the beat of the music, usually using small pulses. You can push yourself as much or as little as you want, so it's excellent for many different levels. They do say they require you to purchase sticky socks for the class. They do have them for sale for $15 up front. That's just an extra add-on that I find a little bit annoying, but the classes are $20 to $25 a class depending on what package you get, which is pretty reasonable, and classes are typically 50 minutes. So, the first thing that surprised me was that it wasn't as much like ballet as I was expecting it to be. I have a dance background, I was expecting it to be similar to a bar class that you take in ballet, and it wasn't. It really felt like a regular workout class, just utilizing the bar. So something else I thought was really interesting is that I got pretty nauseous, but I didn't sweat at all, and I wasn't very out of breath. And I'm a little sore, like uh, my triceps and hamstrings were a bit sore the next day. I checked in on my friend Carrie who took the class with me and she was like, yeah, I'm not sore at all. So I got nauseous. <laughs> I haven't done ballet in like five years, so it's probably because my body was not used to moving like that in a really long time. Even though I just said it wasn't very much like ballet. Another con, really starting out on a positive note here, I found it pretty hard to target exactly what muscle we were supposed to be using. Um, I mean, that's pretty typical when you're starting a new class, but it required a lot of body awareness and it was really fast paced. So there were times where it was pretty hard to keep up, but those are all things that you would get used to after taking a couple classes. So I'd say the class was great for stabilization. It was a lot of isometric movement, which is great for balance. It's good for your body. But if you're looking to tone up or build visual muscle, you probably need more resistance and more weight to achieve that. If you're going five times a week, yeah, you'll see results, but most people don't have the time or money for that. So one more thing before I give my final overview, the sales was a bit aggressive. I got probably four calls before I even took the class. Now, part of that was because they wanted to know your fitness level and what you're looking for in a class. Those are things a personal trainer usually talks to you about beforehand. If you're just trying to take a class, I think it's a little overkill, but if you like that personal attention, then that's great. I personally like to be left alone. So it was a bit aggressive for me. My friend Carrie agreed. It was a little annoying getting all those calls. Um, and then of course, after we got lots of texts and emails, but it is a business. They're trying to sell you something. So that's to be expected. <laughs> Ooh, one thing I forgot is that the teacher, when we were stretching at the end, sprayed essential oils in the room, like turn the lights down low. I have never had someone do that in a class before and it was so pleasant and relaxing. I don't know if it's just that specific teacher who does that or if that's a regular pure bar thing but that was very enjoyable. So final thoughts, I think it would be a great addition to your weekly routine if you're looking for something different. If you want something low impact, it's super low impact, great for that. Um, if you want to add some stabilization and balance into your routine, it's great. This is just based off of one introductory class that I took. They do offer multiple types of classes. So if you do want something more cardio based, I think that they do have a cardio class. The first class is free with no obligation, so there's no reason not to try it, honestly. You may love it. Just because it's not my cup of tea doesn't mean it's not yours. So please get out there, try something new, get those endorphins going. I swear it will make your life better. 
If you like these videos, if you want to see more, subscribe, like, and if you have any suggestions, absolutely give me a comment what you want me to try next.